Hi, I'm Carrie Maletto, and I'm here at the Bass Art Museum in the beautiful South Beach, Miami. We're here to attend the launch event for the 50 U.S. Architects Residential and Planning hardcover book written by award-winning author and editor Demir Sinovic. From Los Angeles, California to Milan, Italy, well-known architects, interior designers, design aficionados, and special guests have all come to Miami for tonight's party. Let's go in. How exciting is it for you to be here tonight at this event? I'm really excited. I'm really thrilled to be included with these other architects. The, the caliber of the work is really good and exciting. You are on the cover of 50 U.S. Architects. And honored I am indeed. The house never looked so good as it does on that cover. The challenge was to try to do something that was interpretive and referential without being historical. I'm uh, ennobled, humbled by, by being included in it. The book is remarkable and a testament to uh, Demir. He's, he's put a lot of effort into this notion of regionalism in architecture and how it informs what the architect is doing. If you really study the book and the architects representing the states, you really see how they do relate to where they are. We won seven national awards. Well, your firm is featured in the 50 U.S. Architects yes. book. It's because of the Tanglewood Two residence in Massachusetts. Right. Can you tell us a little bit more about that property? It's a house that, that I designed for myself and my wife. It's an architectural billboard. Well, definitely it seems like a lot of your heart is in this property. So, have you gotten a chance to see the book yet? I'm very impressed with it. I'm here with Guy Peterson. You're representing the state of Florida in the 50 U.S. Architects book. So this is our third publication with Demir. The level of quality is very high. The uh, quality of the work in the book, I think, is very high, too. So I was very pleased with that. Fifty U.S. Architects features the work of architects across the country, and we're focused on projects that are both modernist in their design philosophy and draw inspiration from vernacular design. Tell us about how you got started working with them. We thought that it was a great project. Very proud of Damir. Uh, he's very talented and everything he's doing with his whole group is so amazing. Books like this give credibility and validity to the, the profession. We launched one of his magazines at our showroom, which was a huge success. It's a really great publication that gives you a real you know, view of what the design and architectural work is in the United States. Just the fact that Demir was able to reach out to architects across the country, I was just uh, very touched and very pleased to have been invited to be part of the project. Meeting Demir tonight totally solidified everything that I thought. I know that he is prominent in the AIA in Florida. Now, did you get a chance to take a peek at the book yet? I did look through the book. It's gorgeous, and I'm very proud to be part of it. You've come all the way from Milano, Italy to be with us tonight. It was a pleasure to come to accept this invitation. We thought it was a very good opportunity to let us people know what Machu is. We're here with Peter and Stella from BC and J Architecture out of Washington State. Welcome to Miami this evening. Have you experienced an honor like this before to be in a printed hardcover book? No, no, this is great. Tell me about your next project. The next project we're working on is East Coast Modern. It's going to be a hardcover book featuring residential design from Florida to Maine. And we're very excited about the project. Where can people find the book and purchase it? That's simple. They can just go to designbookpress.com and order a copy there. Thank you for joining us for the launch of 50 U.S. Architects Residential and Planning Book. Order your copy at designbookpress.com. This is Carrie Maletto at the Bass Museum of Art in beautiful Miami Beach. See you next time.